little ball of super energy in an extremely handsome package. On my planet, people were always after my powers. So I came to yours. It gets a little lonely, but that's okay. I am living my best life on Earth. What? Ow! Hey, what's up, YouTube? Wild Boy, Wild Boy here, and I meant to post this video yesterday on Valentine's Day, but I'm finally getting around to it. Uh, but yesterday I went to go see Sonic the Hedgehog and I wanted to give you guys my opinions and thoughts on it. Uh, I liked it. It was a very, very good movie. I definitely enjoyed it. Uh, it's, it has uh, Ben Schwartz as Sonic, James Madison as Tom, uh, Tom Olaski, and Jim Carrey as Eggman. And it features uh, Sonic and Tom uh, going on an adventure to San Francisco to help Sonic get his rings while trying to get away from Dr. Eggman. It was very, it's kind of more of like a buddy road trip, but it's very, very enjoyable. I definitely liked it. Uh, so far, one of my favorite films of the year. I know that's just the beginning of the year, but uh, but I definitely, definitely enjoyed it. It was supposed to release, be released back in November, but due to the original design, it was very, very bad. But the only reason the video, they had a break, it got delayed. It was supposed to be released back in November, but it got pushed back to February. And the only reason that, that happened because they had to redesign it because the original trailer got so many dislikes. And the only reason that it got so many dislikes is the Sonic design. That's the only reason it got... It got it got messed up or got delayed and everybody was not happy about that. The original design sucked, but you gotta, I told people you gotta look on the brighter note. Jim Carrey was in it and anything Jim Carrey's in. Is, let's talk about Jim Carrey and Sonic the, in the movie. Jim Carrey is fucking amazing in, in this movie. He was absolutely hilarious. He's funny. He made me laugh many many times in this in this movie. He was very very enjoyable. It reminded me of him being a Dumb and Dumber, Ace Ventura, a lot of the '90s movies as well. It was very very good. He was very, very good, and one of my favorite parts about the movie. He's very hilarious, very enjoyable, fucking funny in that movie. It was, like I say, reminds me of a bunch of Ace Ventura, uh, Dumb and Dumb, are very, very funny. Not as funny as he was in those movies, but definitely hilarious. And Ben Schwartz does a very, very amazing job as Sonic. And Tom Matterson, I don't know how he, that's not how you say his name, but Tom Matterson, James Matterson. James Matterson did a fantastic, did a good job as well. This is not one of his first movies he did as a, playing a, with an animated character. He also played in Hop as well and he did enchant it a while back too but yeah it was very very good and uh i definitely enjoyed it i saw it on val i definitely i saw it the day it came out i saw it on valentine's day i went to a seven o'clock mm -hmm. showing on friday and i was very very packed as well and you know very very well done movie i definitely enjoyed it uh what else is there to say about it um here's a, here's a uh it was very good like i said i definitely enjoyed it uh, like I said, my favorite part, my favorite character in the movie was Eggman because he was played by Jim Carrey. Usually my favorite Sonic character is probably Sonic himself, but Jim Carrey did an astounding job as Eggman. He's my favorite character, favorite character in the movie. And there's actually one of my favorite scenes in the movie is when they get into a big bar fight. I'm not going to spoil it too much, but one of my favorite scenes is when they get into a big bar fight or when they're on the, they're on the roof of the San Francisco building. And back to Jim Carrey, he a lot of his lines... I want to take it, guys. A lot of his lines were probably improvised because they were hilarious and not expected. Expected is what Doctor Eggman says. But a lot of stuff because Doctor Eggman sees highly of himself because he see he thinks he's Doctor Eggman sees he's, he seems to be says he seems like he's better than everybody or thinks he's better than everybody, and uh, and Jim Carrey did a good job making him think because he hated everybody in this movie. He hated every character. He only loved the machines, babies, the machine babies, and all of his machines said he was his babies. It definitely, definitely funny. And uh, definitely a lot of, like I said, I'm pretty sure a lot of his stuff was improvised because it seems like it doesn't seem out of character for Jim Carrey us as Eggman, but a lot of his stuff uh, I wouldn't see as Jim Carrey. It's funny because when I usually play my Sonic uh, Sega All Stars races, and when we when Eggman's racing, I'm like, oh, that's Jim Carrey and all that. And I don't want to spoil it too much of the movie for you guys. I did because I'm just as a review, but. Uh, if you're a fan of Sonic the Hedgehog, I recommend staying after the end credits because I don't want to give too much away. I'm not, this is a free spoiler review. I don't want to give it too much away, but if you're a true Sonic the Hedgehog fan, you'll flip your shit during the mid credits season because when I was in there, everybody flipped out over what happened. So, I'm not going to say what happened, but you need to go see it and why you'll see why everybody flipped out. Because when I seen it, everybody flipped out. They started clapping and cheering. I was like, oh, okay, cool. So, I don't want to give too much away, but if you're a true... If you're a diehard Sonic fan, I recommend staying after the end credits. I was going to anyway because I was pretty sure there was something else that had to be in there. And I don't want to give it today, give it too much away. But anyway, what else is, is there to say? Um, speaking of 
Sonic, you know, they, I'm, I'm down for seeing a sequel. Jim Carrey said he would love to do a sequel because he had fun. He said he, he would love to do it because he had fun playing Eggman. I enjoyed him as Eggman. He was very, very funny. A lot of his scenes in the movie were very, very funny. And I definitely, definitely enjoyed him as uh, Eggman. I definitely liked the movie a lot. Uh, there was, uh, is it the greatest movie I've ever seen a, lo a lot? No, it does have its flaws. There's a couple of issues. It's a kid movie. There's fart jokes, burp jokes, a lot of stuff. But it's a kid's movie. What do you expect from those, with those types of movies? It's hilarious. It's funny, though. Uh, one of my favorite, one of, one of my other favorite scenes in the movie is when they're on the roof of San Francisco and Sonic pushes uh, Tom and his wife off the building and Jim and Dr. Eggman is like, uh, what was it? He said, I wasn't expecting that. And then he goes, I was not expect, uh, but I was expected, not expected. So, so it doesn't count. It was pretty funny. Here's a clip if you want to check it out right here. Time for talking is over. It's time to push buttons. Your flying eggs are pretty impressive, Mr. Eggman. But let's face it, you'll never catch me. Confidence. A fool's substitute for intelligence. That's not good. Uh, Sonic, I know you got the super speed and everything, but Maddie and I? Totally defenseless. Probably gonna get blown up. Yeah. Pretty much, yeah. Don't worry. I know exactly what to do. I was not expecting that. But I was expecting not to expect something, so it doesn't count. But what did I overall think of the movie? I definitely enjoyed it. It's not the best movie I've seen. It does have its flaws, but I definitely enjoyed it. So far, it's one of my favorite movies of the year. Like I said, it's the beginning of the year. I'm going to go see Birds of Prey uh, the next tomorrow as well so i'll probably do a review of that i'm trying to bring back movie reviews as well but overall sonic the hedgehog uh 2020 was a very good movie i'm very glad that they decided to go they decided to delay the movie for for redesigning it because imagine how it was with november because there's certain scenes like i know sonic was in the saltwater ocean and he had fishes on his head and then uh like i said he had fish on his head he was what with salt water i'm like wow can you imagine that if they use this old design and with the old decided to keep the old design because a lot of a lot of Disney movies, especially like take Disney for example, a lot of stuff are terrifying. Some stuff they don't even redesign or something. But like the fact that Paramount decided to delay the movie and redesign and spending another thirty million dollars just to redesign it, that's just you have to go see it. To anybody who complained about it, who complained about it on YouTube, complained about it on Twitter, Facebook, you know, you gotta go see the movie now because you complained about it. That's personally my opinion. One 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 complaint equals one ticket. If you were complaining about it, you gotta go see the movie before it comes out on DVD. And if you're a diehard fan of Sonic, you need to go see the movie. Especially stay until the end credits or after the end credits because it's very, very... You're gonna flip your shit if you're a diehard Sonic fan. Overall, like I said, is Sonic the Hedgehog the best movie I've seen? No, I'm not a by long shot, but I definitely did enjoy it. It does have its flaws, but I definitely recommend it to kids or if you're a, very, if you're a diehard Sonic fan. Uh, I'm not a die-hard Sonic fan. I'm a, huge, I'm a fan of Sonic. I like the Sonic Sega All-Star races. I play a lot of Sonic games. I want to. I've been hoping that one day I can play the original Sonic the Hedgehog on Sega Genesis. So that's the Sega games. So, but definitely, I definitely would recommend Sonic the Hedgehog to pretty much everybody, especially kids and people who are die-hard friends of Sonic the Hedgehog. But what do you guys think of Sonic the Hedgehog movie? I definitely enjoyed it. Let me know what you think in the comments. Thank you guys a lot for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all in a future video. Take it easy. Why would you throw your life away for this silly little alien? Good time. He's my friend. Let's go! This is my power. And I'm using it to protect my friends. Let's go! Let's go! So, you're supposed to be Tom's best friend that he won't shut up about. Well, I don't see the appeal. That is very gross! Let's go!